This is the Patreon Picks World War 3 60 man free ring battle royal. The winner gets a shot at the NLW 24 7 championship currently held by The Undertaker, who is coincidentally also in this match. So if he wins, nobody is getting the shot. But for that one lucky man or woman in this match, they will get a shot, the next shot in ring against The Undertaker. There's three rings. Once we are down to five men in each ring, then they will convene to the center. It's over the top rope. Both feet must hit the floor. Who is going to become the number one contender? We are about to find out right now. This huge match underway. Three rings, the biggest match in NLW 24-7 history. There are legends. There are current superstars. There's a whole bunch of different athletes in this one. You've got the red ring over to the right, the middle black ring. You've also got the blue ring. And you can see everybody's paired off. Each Patreon viewer, $3 and over, got to choose a member of this match. And now you can see... Well, there's uh, Mr. Freshly Squeezed, Orange Cassidy, going right for the 24-7 champion, The Undertaker. But The Undertaker not phased, and Orange Cassidy thrown out. And meanwhile, on the other side of the arena, Dustin Rhodes gets suplexed out. And meanwhile, the Hurricane goes after Nia Jax. But the Hurricane thrown out by Jax. And uh, as I said before, if The Undertaker wins this one, he wants to prove that he is unstoppable. But MJF trying to stop John Cena right there. We got 60 men in there, but who is getting eliminated next? It looks like it's going to be Ricochet with a Superman punch from Roman Reigns. And you know what? I want to give a shout out to all of my Patreon subscribers. You'll find a list of their names in the description as Liger gets Judas Effect for his troubles as Dean Malenko gets thrown out by Strowman. There's a lot going on in that ring, a sea of humanity at the moment. The Lucha Brothers going after Cody. You see Moxley in there. Goldberg going after Kevin Owens, MJF, and Cena pairing off. There's a bunch of interesting talent. Hangman Page and Randy Orton. The Undertaker set his sights on Jeff Hardy there. Roman Reigns, Triple H, and Sting over on the other side. There's Darby with Rey Mysterio and the Stun Dog Millionaire to Rey. As Ciampa runs at China. And Ciampa thrown out. And the only two women in this match staring off, perhaps the two most powerful women in wrestling. China and Nia Jax now trying to fight. But here comes Randy Orton to sneak up behind and eliminate China and Nia Jax. And an RKO to John Morrison for good measure. The winner of this match gets the next in-ring opportunity for the 24-7 title. So the 24-7 rule is on hold during this battle royal as Murphy delivers the V-trigger to Billy Kidman after the shooting star press failed. And now Murphy, oh, and he goes after Kane, who nearly eliminated Seth Rollins. And the double team from the Lucha Brothers, the Destroyer, and now Kurt Angle thrown out. Look out for Goldberg with the spear. And lifts up Moxley for the jackhammer. And Cody from behind eliminates Goldberg. And Kevin Owens with a stunner. Owens stunning. Cody and gets thrown out. And Riddle with the knee eliminates Eddie Edwards. And Triple H eliminates Riddle. And there's Mike Awesome with the awesome bomb to Eddie Guerrero. Meanwhile, Pac with a Rana. And shockingly, Mike Awesome eliminated. Meanwhile, Chris Sabin with a Hail Sabin. And now, Alistair Black with a black mass gets rid of Sabin and Morrison. But a bro kick from Sheamus. The action's thick and fast here. Pentagon Jr. wants to snap the arm of Edge. But from behind, his own brother Phoenix eliminates Pentagon. That just goes to show you, it's every man for himself in this World War III three-ring, 60-man battle royal. You see the blue ring filled up 
The black ring as well is emptying as Sammy Callahan. Very close to being eliminated by Batista. Meanwhile, Hardy and Pack and Matt Hardy and Sting on the other side. Meanwhile, Kane's being double teamed by the Messiahs. And Darby Allen with a drop kick to the back of the 24-7 champion, The Undertaker. The winner of this match gets a shot, Undertaker. And now the coffin drop. And Rey Mysterio with a Rana. But what if Undertaker is able to win this? How incredible would that be? Taking out all the competition as RVD kicks Rey Mysterio out of here. And Eddie Guerrero with a kick. And there goes Van Damme. Rob Van Damme out of here. And Razor Ramon in trouble. The German suplex sends him out as Finn Balor works over Randy Orton. Meanwhile, Phoenix runs along the ropes and gets speared. And now Phoenix thrown out by Edge. And meanwhile, Sammy Callahan choking out Alistair Black. And Batista with a Batista bomb to Sheamus in the centre. But Lesnar's there with a German suplex. The biggest battle royal in Pickfed history right here. And again, Buddy Murphy. Choke slammed on the apron by Kane. And from behind his own brother. His own brother eliminating him. Meanwhile, one final beat from Johnny Gargano to Andrade. But on the shoulders of Brock Lesnar, not where you want to be. F5 and Gargano has escaped this match. Lesnar on fire. But look out for Handman. With a buck shot, eliminates Brock Lesnar. But a low blow from MJF. And MJF throws out Hangman Page. And Finn Balor with a drop kick. And now MJF eliminated. Elimination's coming thick and fast. As CM Punk delivers the knee to John Moxley. And the blue ring has all ganged up on Braun Strowman. They see him, the largest man in the match, who's just been thrown out. Braun is gone. See Hollywood Hogan, he wants his 24-7 title back after he lost it to Seth Rollins who just got a swanton for his troubles and now Triple H went for the pedigree but back dropped over. And it's a spear from Roman to Jeff Hardy. Now has his hands on broken mat and throws him out for his troubles. Sheamus on the apron and Andrade with a runner. He manages to hang on. Sheamus is gone. But Sammy Callahan with a huge discus punch. Andrade's gone and... Oh, went for the black mass but missed. And now Callahan with a package pile driver. And figure four coming from Flair. But no! The V-trigger from Omega. And now from behind, Hollywood Hogan eliminates Kenny. Hogan hulking up as AJ Styles and Edge... Battling in the other corner and Pack on the top with a black arrow to Hardy. But Sting's there to throw out Pack. The bastard's gone. And now a Sting a splash to the Undertaker, but Eddie Guerrero throws out Sting. And in the blue ring, GTS and Jericho falls out. But CM Punk not looking as he gets a super kick. And Finn Balor looking for Bloody Sunday and now Cena gets rid of Balor. The eliminations coming thick and fast as I said. Owens with a pop-up powerbomb and now Moxley throws out the prize fighter. And now we are down to five wrestlers in each ring. That means they now go to the centre ring to fight. To see who will win as a frog splash is delivered from Eddie Guerrero but The Undertaker throws out Eddie everyone now to the centre but Edge and Styles still fighting and Hogan throws out Edge and Hogan hot dogging and grandstanding but AJ Styles drop kicks Hogan out of the match revenge for the Survivor Series match a few weeks ago where it was the NWO versus Bullet Club here on NLW 24-7 but there's a paradigm shift to Shawn Michaels, AJ now, double springboard, 450, taking out Moxley, there's only about 10 or 12 wrestlers left in the centre of the ring, who is going to get eliminated next, 
It is Batista who gets RKO'd and thrown out. And now an RKO to Jeff Hardy. Meanwhile, Roman Reigns, the Tribal Chief, trying to eliminate Rollins. And Orton throws them both out. Randy Orton would love to get the next shot, the 24-7 title. But sweet chin music and he's thrown out. Remember what Shawn Michaels said this past week on NLW 24-7. He said he wanted to be the one to take the title from The Undertaker. As Undertaker throws out Callahan. And now the STF applied from John Cena. And now go for the Stars Clash on Alistair Black. But AJ thrown to the apron. Springs in. Black Mass. And Moxley eliminates Styles, but not before. A Black Mass to Moxley. And Moxley thrown out. Alistair Black on fire. Oh, but not for long. Attitude adjustment to Alistair Black. And that's switch your music. No, caught. Span around. Attitude adjustment out, maybe. No. On the apron. Suplex. And Cena eliminated by HBK. Shawn Michaels skins the cat. Hardy looks to eliminate him. But no. Hardy eliminated. And now we're down to three. But Michaels went after the Undertaker. But got caught. Now Black. Double tombstone. What power shown by the 24-7 champion. One of two things is going to happen. Either Black or Michaels is going to win and go on to challenge The Undertaker. Or The Undertaker is going to win this and make claim to be the best of all time. But there's a Black Mass and a power bomb. As I said, if The Undertaker wins this, he does not have to challenge anybody. But now Black may be eliminated here. Chunks land out. But Michaels going after Taker. But Black is still hanging on. Drop kick. And now Black eliminates The Undertaker. The Undertaker's gone. Either Shawn Michaels or Alistair Black is going to become the number one contender. And it's going to be Alistair Black. Alistair Black is the number one contender. Well, Alistair Black, at last, 59 other wrestlers to earn a shot one-on-one -on -one versus The Undertaker. No interference, no distractions, Black versus Taker. Well, an incredible three-ring battle royal we had on our hands right here. The eliminations were coming thick and fast. Alistair Black, very much the MVP of this one. Shawn Michaels, though, you sense the desperation in his voice on our last NLW 24-7. He went to The Undertaker and said, I'm going to be the one to take the title from you. But it's not going to be that way. Alistair Black looked to have been eliminated, but his feet hung on. Michaels and Black teamed up to eliminate the 24-7 champion. And that left Black and Shawn Michaels to battle one-on-one. -on -one, and then the Black Mass eliminating Michaels. And Alistair Black wins World War Three. The Undertaker is the 24-7 champion. The next one-on-one -on -one match for that title will be in that very ring as Alistair Black looks to take the championship from the Deadman.